What's going on everybody? RHC here. Probably gonna have a short little little episode of Toilet of RHC here. Probably won't be as long as usual. So my Walmart has not stocked new SummerSlam Elites, nor have they got Elite Series 59, as 56 seems to be the only set left. In fact, pretty much one of everybody won as last time. I mean AJ there was two of, but I mean besides this basic right here. Which speaking of basics, even though basics may not be as good as they used to be. I'm still gonna buy some because look what they got. They got a couple of Alexa Bliss figures. And it looks like there's a fresh case of Series 85 here, along with remnants of Series 84. Except for Rollins, that's a badass figure. Oh, and I just knocked a few up uh, figures over. Uh, pick this up real quick. But yeah, um, so we got that. That, of course, John Cena by himself. Well, we go from the goddess to being glorious. I got Bobby Roode, and there's two of him in stock. And Dean Ambrose, which I picked him up in my previous episode of Twins of RHC. And, and also Baron Corbett and Rich Swan. So definitely got to get my hands on this Alexa Bliss. And got to pick up Bobby Roode. And you know what? Why not? Because I just saw him earlier. Where'd I put him? Gonna pick up stuff for the hell of it. I mean, I wish I could have found some elites, but you know what? I'll I'll call this good. Not a whole else to look at, though. Um, I mean, just really about the same. Actually, I don't know. Transformers are starting to tempt me a little bit, but I just don't know if, don't know if I can get too big in transport collecting again. <laughs> and really, that's about it. I don't see anything in pops that are worth looking at. No WWE pops when I was trying to look. Uh, yeah, that's really about it. I mean, not a bad selection of stuff. I wish there was more in Elites, but hey, you know, good set of stuff here. And also, they have stocked a recent set of Battle Packs. You wouldn't know what Shamus and Zara because they're in two different sets, I believe. Series 49 and Series 52, I mean, really. Yeah. But yeah, um, of course, I'm going to pick up some other ones here, of course. This may be a spoiler of SummerSlam if Extreme Rules has already happened by the time I put this video up. Don't care for that battle pack, but... Um, let's see if I can find the other battle pack. Yes, yeah, Usos, which is not bad. A little better than their Elites, but I don't really need another set of Usos right now. But, um, yeah, that's about it. This will be kind of a short episode of Toy Hunt of RHC. Hope I said that right. Toy Hunt of RHC. I kind of spoke fast. Eh, we might look, take a look, quick look at the Hot Wheels, but other than that, it'll probably be my three pickups for the time being, unless I find something special. <laughs> okay, this is going to be the last stop for the video. We're going to take a look at the Hot Wheels, and so far not seen a whole lot I really want or need. I already have this Mustang, unfortunately, but it's still cool. But I definitely do like this 4 GT. I think I might get it. Eh, this Camaro's pretty badass. This one also kind of interests me a little bit. Can't get wrong with Ford GT, I guess. I mean, eh, besides that, not a whole else that I really care for. Oh uh, yeah, I guess that's really about it, though. So definitely might have to pick up some of these Hot Wheels here for the hell of it. my basics that's probably about it for all I'm picking up today so uh, that's about it guys of course yeah here's everybody else didn't really care about getting Cena and I think I've got enough AJ at the moment I say you never can have too much AJ but I think I'll pass on that figure for now <laughs> but that's about it anyways guys thanks for watching rock on and keep collecting all right guys obviously that wasn't the end of the video this this probably will be I was just trying to get things wrapped up while I was in the Hot Wheels section. Which actually, out of every section in the in the toy section, I think the Hot Wheels aisle seems to be the busiest. That's why I started kind of talking low compared to the figure aisle. But anyways, uh, basically everything you saw in the video is what I picked up. So, quick recap. The basics, all from Series 85. Seth Rollins, which I have plenty of his basics and elites. Would have loved to have found the SummerSlam Elite, but hey, not going to complain. I'll keep trying. I know Amazon has started selling them. The Goddess Alexa Bliss, my favorite my favorite female superstar on Raw, and my favorite women's wrestler in, in general in the WWE. I also have her first basic from, I think it's Series 68B, 
and also her Elite Series 52 figure. I kind of was a little bummed they don't have the new battle pack of her and Nia Jax yet, because I definitely want to get my hands on that one. But this figure, I think, might have been my favorite of all my pickups today. The Glorious Bobby Roode. And uh, it's actually my first Bobby Roode figure in Mattel form. I have yet to get the NXT Takeover figure or the, uh, I think it was an NXT taste, but I think it was actually a Takeover Basic and Elite. Plus the entrance grate, which I, you know, I haven't seen online for a cheap price. Maybe other than the ringside, but whatever. Hey, I'm glad I have him. Actually, my first Baru figure in eight years, because there was a TNA figure I have of his from a two-pack of him and James Storm. So, yeah. It's cool to have, have a Mattel version of him now. And finally, the Hot Wheels. Not too much of Hot Wheels. 2016 Ford GT Race. Nice 2017 Camaro ZL1. And a 17 Ford GT. So, hey, not bad. It seems like nowadays that uh, WWE figures and Hot Wheels are the only thing I really collect anymore. For the most part, since I'm not getting too interested in the new Ninja Turtles cartoon coming out or anything Power Rangers related that's not... You know, the late in the legacy line. Now, finally, if you guys remember last week's episode, I ended the episode actually with a, not a toy pickup, but uh, a DVD pickup. Well, it was a Blu-ray slash DVD. But you know what? Um, why not? I guess every now and then I'll pick up Blu-rays and show them if they relate to what I buy. So all I'd say is, Sierra, Hotel, India, Echo, Lima, Delta, Shield. Dun-dun, 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 dun-dun. <laughs> yep, I saw this at Walmart while I was in the electronics section. I was like, you know, I'm gonna pick it up. Why not? The Shield's always been one of the, you know, most badass groups in the history of WWE. Especially since one of my favorite guys is in the group, Dean Ambrose. And of course, I like Rollins too. Roman, I'm meh. But, anyways, yeah, definitely had to get this. Three discs set. Here's the back of it. Shows featured matches in here. So it's like, why not? And as of this video, I don't know. Could Ambrose be back from injury? There has been rumor he should be back at Extreme Rules. They say he's definitely clear and tied for SummerSlam. So I guess we'll have to see. And hey, if he turns heel, I'm, I don't have a problem with that. But anyways, guys, um, those are my pickups for the time being. Thanks for watching another episode of Toy Hunt FRC. As always, rock on and keep collecting.